looks like another frequent upload. Today is just a uh, review day of a gun that I have in my schematic list of a lot, a lot of schematics. As you can see, I have a lot. Um, yeah. And, uh, out of all of them, uh, I'm only going to be reviewing one of them today. And that one is... This motherfucker. Uh, this gun is pretty good for headshot damage, as you can see. Pretty alright damage as body. And, obviously, you can see the perks on it. Very, uh... A lot of perk. Pretty fucking good perks, actually. Jack's Revenge. It's a weapon that was in the game, I think. Yeah, okay, it's right here. It's a pirate weapon. I You could get it from... I don't remember. You could get it from... I don't remember you could get it from. I think you got it out of a llama, maybe? But you can't really get it anymore, as you can see. You need a weapon voucher. Along with all these other weapons that I have. Anyway, but... We'll go into a mission real quick, and I'll show them off. Alright. Alright. So now that we're in a mission, taking a look at this gun, pretty easy. First off, it has collateral shots. So if you don't know what collateral means, you are living under a rock. And it just means that you can hit multiple targets if they are lined up on your shot. Which is not very common for a pistol. A pistol would normally just hit one target and just be like, fuck you. And, you know... This pistol's headshot damage is practically unmatched. And as you can see, it's doing hella damage to the husks. Headshot damage or not. And this still will hit headshots through collateral. You just gotta line up your shots right. The perks are definitely better with physical, and just headshot damage on this pistol is way better overall. Pirate heroes will do a lot better, because some of them have pistol damage upgrades, like perks. And that will even further increase the damage. Also, you can use Lynx's ability, which will increase damage like this when you're up in the air. Which will further increase the damage you deal with this pistol. And I would definitely prefer this over a duelist. Because a duelist, even though it has more magazine size... It just deals a lot more damage. I'm pretty... Do I have a duelist schematic? I don't. Well, that doesn't really matter, because I don't like duelists. Jack's Revenges are way better. But the reason why I haven't used it very much is because when it first came into the game, Chrome Huskies were still in, and Chrome Huskies are an absolute nightmare. By far the worst husk in this game. Worse than the Nurse Husks, the healer ones. And they are definitely worse than smashers because they just will not die if you don't know what chrome huskies are you know you're you're better off not knowing i would not even look it up oh speak of the devil no <laughs> leave me alone I got those taken care of now. And I could always review other weapons. Deatomizer, pot shot, powder keg, mythic weapons, candy corn, anything like that. Just let me know in the comments what you want to see. And then also do a poll on my Discord server too. And, you know, there's a link to my Discord server in the description as always. The server hit 350 members not too long ago and... The closer we get to 500 members to get partnered on Discord is... It's it's gonna happen soon. I haven't even had this server up for three months, and it's already have... It already has 350 members. I never really expected it was gonna get this big that quickly. 
but you can join the Discord server if you want to. It's purely optional. You don't have to if you don't want to. But we do offer MSK carries, uh, pre-quest carries, a lot of giveaways. And, you know, you got some people in there who do help with ventures. Um, if you do want to host your own giveaways for people, just ask one of the mods, ask me or one of the mods, and we can give you a giveaway host roll and you can start doing giveaways of your own and you know if you like this video leave a like and i will see you guys in the next one